Lee, the tonight show, the bluffs and colleges all across the East Coast, coming out of the 804 Richmond, Virginia. Give it up for Travis Charles. Celebrities are weird people, man. They are. They're really weird. 
Uh, anybody in here really quick a uh, Justin Bieber fan? Cool, good deal. Uh, <laughs> no, I just, I just found out the other day that diehard Justin Bieber fans call themselves Believers. <laughs> Game. Uh, but look, I started looking at other celebrities, right? Now, actually, a lot of celebrities use their name to give their fans nicknames. Like, if you're a very Manilow fan, you become a Fanilo. Right? If you're a Hulk Hogan fan, you become a Hulkamaniac. But if you're a Rosie O'Donnell fan, you become a Dyke. <laughs> sound like I'm anti-gay. I'm not. I really don't care. But I have realized that I can actually never be gay due to the fact that I don't wipe my ass good enough to be gay. <laughs> That's like having a sticky coochie for a girl. It's like, what? I don't like to put it in you. What? Oh, it's me. You just smell it through your jeans. Come on. <laughs> okay. Either I'm offended a lot of sticky coochie girls. <laughs> smoking pretty much. Um, so really quick in the room, by a round of applause, where are my smokers at still in the room? Smokers? Yeah. Cool. Um, actually, I hate smokers. <laughs> but look, not for the fact that you guys smoke, all right? Y'all just say dumb shit about smoking. Like, oh man, there's nothing more I need after a good meal than a cigarette. Or, oh man, there's nothing more I need after good sex than a cigarette. I don't get it. Because after a good meal, all I need is a napkin. <laughs> and after good sex, pretty much all I need is a napkin. <laughs> all right, guys, I'm about to get out of here. Uh, I'm let you know that uh, comedy is not always my full-time job. I used to have a day job back in Richmond, Virginia, where I'm from. I used to work for a company called Comcast Cable. Yeah. I got fired in November, okay? Because every customer's house I went to, I talked them into going to Verizon. <laughs> cool, crazy shit. My favorite story, I went to a house one day, right? I knock on the door, the door opens up, little boy runs out, tags on my jeans, he goes, hey, my mommy sucks dick for coke. <laughs> How much coke? Like, what would she do for a Klondike bar? <laughs> 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 